you're intercepting that hand there. Yeah. But just because you intercept it doesn't mean that I can't grab that stick and then, you know, bang it and hit you with that stick. Right. So you have to look for all these things. Yeah, in a drill it's perfect and we stop it there. Yeah. But in the application when I stop it there, I'm not stopping there. I'm still pulling through. You see how you grab my stick? Yeah. There you go. I put that stick behind the back and I grab that stick. Right? Why behind the back? Because if I go like this, right? Here, yeah. you go here. And you grab my stick, right? And I have it in the front and I let it go. All you have to do is, boom, pull it. Yeah, or, or and punch it, jab it, or pull it out. There you go, and then now you have my stick. But from here, from here, you grab the stick. Yeah. If I put it back there, then now I have that and I have yeah. this. You know what I mean? If I put it back there, yeah. then I have that and then I have two and I can release and punch. Yeah. As I release and punch, I'm crowding this stick. Okay. Right? So how would you take that stick out? You can't go up. It's behind my back. How are you going to take it out? There you go. And then you come back with it. Right. And then, and then this is my movement. Now it's disarmed. I lost it. I was trying to keep it, but I lost it. Okay. But when I lose it, did I go for the stick? No. No, I'm focusing on the battle. Right. Because from here, if that shot's coming to the head, boom. This is my entries. Boom. Yeah. Oh, right. Yeah, you see? So we go into empty hand uh, against stick. So again, any time that something happens in a drill that is not uh, part of that drill, uh, we try to do a finish move. Okay. We try to go to you know, the next level of training, even if it's for like a beat or a three count. We don't want to struggle, we just want to say, hey look, I'm still ready, I'm still you know, alert, and um, you know, I still have my other skills. All right?